Good day, everyone. Welcome back to TSG Cards, and it is time. Surprise, surprise. I am opening up a 2020-2021 Upper Deck Premier Hockey Hobby Box. We've got, what, six cards in here, I believe. Six cards? Six cards. I think it says six cards. Six premium cards, one pack per box. A retail value of $600 for this, but I did not spend $600 on this. I entered a group break. I entered a couple of group breaks. And I won a sealed hobby box from one of the group breaks. So I got very lucky. I only entered a couple hundred dollars worth of group break. Got some cards as well, as you've probably seen in Mail Day. One of them I didn't really get anything in. So again, group breaks are crapshoots. But I gave it a go. And uh, yeah, so very, very excited to actually be able to open up this product. Very nerve-wracking at the same time because the you know the hype around it all the skyrocketing price of the hobby i just feel like with premier and ultimate recently it's very very unsustainable um and i look at some of the ultimate packs and it just makes me wonder like four cards for three four hundred dollars and i almost think premier's more, better bang for your buck um than ultimate is and it's just yeah it's just i can't i can't i can't imagine it so anyway let's set up one i've got another couple stands in the background here i've got my sleeves ready beside me i am nervous so um without further ado let's dive into premiere so what we're really hunting in here is the rpas and rookie patch autos I'd be very careful with this i would like to savor the box a little bit uh, i've seen some really beautiful tim stutz the patch cards pulled um and here we are with the premiere pack so See how careful I can be. That feels like a really thick pack. I don't know how thick they're supposed to be, but it feels like a pretty good size pack. So um, you can take a look at the odds if you're looking for anything there, if you haven't already. But um, those Asti autograph patch cards, you get one per box. So hopefully we can get maybe a gold parallel number to 65 would be nice. Um, there's lots and lots of great cards in here. So. There also are lots of dud cards in here, so it's very, it is very polarizing. I have a product, and um, yeah, just very, very nerve wracking. So I will carefully open this one up, um, and we will see how we do here. I carefully open this guy up, trying not to reveal everything. the cards out and I'm going to decoy this hopefully without seeing okay so we have decoyed it and we've got a few thick cards so that is good news that is a good sign and maybe what I will do is actually we'll push these guys up around here Move that premier thing out of the way. This is my first time opening up a product. This is the most expensive product I have opened up. Um, let's see it. Okay, there we go. Okay, we've got the two stands ready. Oh my gosh. All right, so let us. How many cards did I pick up? Just one or two? I picked up two. Okay. Oh, hopefully. Oh, this might be. I, I think I'm ruining it. I think I'm ruining it. But our first card is. A Connor McDavid base out of 299. So if there is a card to hit with these base veterans, it is the number one card in the deck, Connor McDavid. That is a beautiful card to get. The design is super sleek. Very, very happy with this. So that is amazing right there. Nice Connor McDavid base card right there. Gorgeous. So if we had to hit one, that's one to hit. I'm uh, rethinking all of this right now set that back up i've readjusted i'm so sorry <laughs> all right so for now we'll set connor up there just sleeved him up and we'll move on to the second card which is a ty delandria gold rookies premier rookies out of 65 so 49 out of 65 beautiful card right there so that is real real nice so ty delandria not a bad name, but not great either. All right, so we'll set Ty Delandry up there in the background. And we'll go from the bottom, because the bottom is generally not a... Oh, would you look at that? 
to join Ty Delandria, we have his jersey cards, the base jersey, um, not numbered, so unfortunate there. And there's a little bit of a bend to that card there, a little bit. But uh, yeah, nothing too special. So we'll get that guy sleeved up. But unfortunately, three cards in, although it is probably the three lowest end cards that we're going to get, not the greatest. All right, again, from the bottom, we've got Chris Letang and Evgeny Malkin, Premier Mega Jersey Duos, 41 out of 49. So that's pretty solid. Good names for sure. Again, look at that bend. My gosh. And maybe you can't see it as well on camera, but I see a pretty big bend in that. So that's not the greatest. But hey, that's not bad names to get jersey cards. So I'm hoping for two autos. Now I think you're supposed to get at least two autos in here. But uh, they better be big autos because... <laughs> So far, not so great. So we will move. Uh, let's do Connor McDavid. We'll just put him down there for his base there and set that up. So we'll go on. Let's go to the top card next here. And let's do, we've got Calvin Thurkoff, rookie auto patch, acetate with a gorgeous looking patch out of 249. Wow, look at that. Isn't that incredible? A little bit of corner damage, unfortunately, there. But holy geez, that is incredible. Beautiful card. Unfortunately, the name is not great. It's not a great name. Um, but it is a really, really nice looking card. So uh, very happy with that. And that leaves us with one more card. And uh, let's see what it is. Again, it was a pretty thick card. So, so it's rookie, rookie Paramount. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What? No. This could arguably be my greatest pull of all time. 10 out of 49. Rookie Paramount Premier Auto Patch Kirill Kaprizov. Look at that. That is one touch worthy. My gosh. The, I'm looking to see how the edges are and everything. There is like some minor nicks there. In the corners and the bottom edge isn't ideal, but isn't that a phenomenal card? So I will go and grab a quick one touch for that. My goodness, that is an absolutely gorgeous card of arguably the best player you could get. Numbered out of 49. Oh my god. Ty Delandria party is over, my friends. Over the thrill of Kirill has arrived. This is insane. I can't even believe it right now. I won this box and my gosh, did it ever turn out for me. The luck is just incredible. I can't get over that. The other cards were left a lot to be desired, but this just more than made up for it. That is incredible. If I can find some sort of comparable value, I will post it, but that is crazy. So Wow. Thank you everyone so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Lots of great content coming out soon. I've been doing a little bit of grading, so I've uh, sent some cards off for grading, including arguably my biggest card that I pulled before this, which I think this is now topped. So this is just wild. So <laughs> no pun intended. Minnesota Wild. Karel Kaprizov, thank you so much for joining the party today. Thank you everyone for watching and joining the party. We'll see you guys again soon with some more great content on the channel. Bye for now.